What's going on guys, Mr. Leprechaun here today. Today we are back with another toge run with the Scottish the Scotch Mountain and we are with the Z32 which is which is which was a hard one because you just seen at the start she gave us a wee burnout which I didn't want as you see she tried to drift and that is what the disadvantage is with this car is that she's a back wheel drive and the other two cars were gonna be four wheel drives. But it was just a fun wee challenge to see the 32s go up against each other. I just thought it was a fun little thing. Did I think she did well? She had 490 something, somewhere around there, 90. I say, yeah, 490 horsepower, which I try to tune it up to get to the 500s. It's going to be such a disadvantage on this car. It was a slow power car, but I try to keep all the stock engines, but do them up, like tune up the engines. But um, yeah, this car is definitely, I had to give it the, all of the, I had to rev it so high, get it, give it to all that it could go. I didn't go slow on it, I, I didn't uh, try to make it lose, but we don't know yet, we're not at the end of the week yet, so um, hopefully the she, she's not too far back. Um, I'm going to find out obviously when I edit the last videos, I'm going to know, but I hope she's... It is one of my favorite cars too, one of my Jetty M cars, but this is more of a stancy car for me, so taking this out, this is obviously not built to be a stance car right now, but obviously I hit this fence because she swung over that side to the left, but this is what I would usually do with this car, I'd usually stance it, I've never toge it, so this was my first time toge in it, which um, I don't know, I don't know, uh, let me know what you think, how the car did, because you obviously you've seen the R32 um, GTR video and just let me know what you think who looks better I already know who looks better I'm not gonna be biased I'm not even gonna say it um, I do love this car but I know this car is definitely not a toge car she wants to drift but I wouldn't I wouldn't even drift it either this if I had this car in real life I wouldn't even drift it it'd be a stance car that's about it but um yeah I was just so I just give it all but coming around the corners it was pretty scary because as you see she just wants to whip out like that's all she wants to do she doesn't want to do, she, she's like, what are you doing with me? I don't want to be toge in these roads. I want to be, my back end wants to be out. Which, I, I don't know, should I put a four-wheel drive? Would that give it a better? But then it's not being its own car. It's just getting, you know, it's not really that's real potential of a car. But I know if I put a different engine into it, it could have been a, be, a lot better car. But right now, I just kept the stock engine with the twin turbos already in it. Just upgraded the turbos. And I did try to tune them all, but it didn't really make a difference. I thought she was still pretty fast. It was just the corners that let it down. And obviously this is what Tokyo ends about, is corners. So she was pretty slow. But I think all the, the other cars are pretty slow in the corners anyway. Because it's slowed down anyway. But it's just taken back off is what is the problem. That's why the four-wheel drive is a lot better. Because it just grips again. Like this one doesn't. It just bogs down. And I have to change back in the down a gear. Which was kind of a hassle because once I put it down gear and it was in higher revs it as you see it just tries to spin out or drift but once I get out of here I thought I was gonna hit that wall so that was a dramatic break which I, f I just don't know if it's gonna let me down we're, we're gonna we're gonna find out it's exciting we're exciting to see what 32 is gonna win um I, I I'm gonna be honest I don't think this is gonna be my one that's gonna win but if she wins I'd be amazed that'd be crazy but I don't think she is but it was cool to have her in the little 32 group coming here I just let her open I uh, don't think I topped the speed because she was just bouncing because such a fat looking car it just bounces up and down the road which is probably should have stiffened the extension a bit more because uh, like I got scared here and it kind of break I was like hell no and then she whips out take that sign out because it's just a sign whatever no one cares about it um yeah but as you can see she's just shaking like this is not for her she's not happy but um i think she did pretty well for pushing it and not tra not spinning out that's one thing i didn't do um she definitely didn't spin out uh but she definitely wanted to spin out but i just controlled her pretty well and um, yeah so coming to the end so if you did enjoy, make sure you hit a like and make sure you subscribe if you're new. And let me know who you want to win and which one's your favorite car. I'm not gonna be biased. I'm not gonna say nothing to the last video. I won't know the last video. I'm gonna have to make another edit with all M3. 
cars maybe might do that so yeah if you'd enjoy i already said all that shit